Prime Minister Narendra Modi has just concluded his visit to Qatar. A visit, he said, has added new vigour to the ties between the two sides. Prime Minister Modi's visit was significant to say the least. It came a week after Qatar released eight Indian nationals sentenced to deaths after being arrested in the year 2022. The visit marked a big step towards reconciliation. In August 2022, the eight ex-Navy personnel were arrested on espionage charges. It had led to diplomatic tensions. Just a few days ago, we told you about the return of the Indian nationals. India managed to secure their release and bring them home to their families. They landed from Qatar. It was a big win for Indian diplomacy and for the Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Let's just go back to talking about Prime Minister Modi's visit to Qatar. Upon arriving in Doha, Prime Minister Modi was accorded a ceremonial welcome. He described his meeting with his Qatari counterpart, the Qatari Prime Minister, as wonderful. And during his less than 24-hour visit, uh, Prime Minister Modi held wide-ranging talks with the Qatari Emir. They focused on expanding ties in areas of trade, energy, investment and new technology. And after meeting with the Emir, Prime Minister Modi said that India looks forward to scaling up cooperation with the Gulf nation. The leaders also discussed recent regional developments in West Asia. They stressed on the importance of upholding peace and stability in the region and beyond. The meeting coming at a time when trade and energy ties between India and Qatar are on an upswing. In fact, Qatar is the largest supplier of LNG to India, accounting for over 48% of India's global LNG imports. Recently, India's Petronet has renewed a contract to buy 7.5 million tons of LNG from Qatar annually from 2029 for 20 years. It is being billed as the largest ever extension of super chilled fuel in the world. The original 25-year deal was signed in 1999 and supplies had started in 2004. This was Prime Minister Modi's last international trip ahead of the crucial general elections in India in the coming summer and his trip to Qatar along with the UAE symbolizing India's evolved relations with the Gulf in the last 10 years. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the updates on the move.